What is going on guys? Kevin over at Lake Bros coming back to you with another video today. This one was from Blake, I think it was. Contacted me on eBay and then made a private lot for me. So shout out to you, Blake. This one was $100. I think it ended up being about a pound uh, of figures. Yeah, one pound, six ounces actually of figures. So uh, that was with the box weight and everything like that. So great deal, no matter what. Um, but we're going to see what we can find in here. Stores.ebay.com slash Lake Bros where you can find some of this stuff. You can also... also Oh, so you can also join me on whatnot where you will get $15 off your first purchase now with my link down below in the description it used to be 10. Now it is $15 off, uh, which is a nice, cool thing as well. Uh, I am an affiliate with whatnot as well now. So that is pretty cool. Shout out to whatnot. Awesome platform. Uh, this is one of those Chima ripper things, which is kind of cool. It's spinny. Spinny. Or just a fidget spinner if you need one. Uh, we won't need that. We won't need that. But uh, also some Ninjago cards. My kids will probably play with those, to be honest. I'm not going to sell those or anything like that. So my kids will be happy that we have some more of those. Shout out to you, Blake. Thank you very much for those. All right, let's go ahead and get started. Uh, all the other links down below in the description, as well as the P.O. Box. Uh, you can always contact me on Instagram or on eBay or on wherever whatnot, wherever, if you want to sell your collection to me, just like Blake did. This was Marvel Super Heroes, apparently. Apparently, this was the Marvel Super Heroes bag. Look at this. Look at this. Heartbreaker. Heartbreaker armor right there. We have a Ghost Rider. This is the new version of Ghost Rider. Not sure the value. I don't remember the last time I sold that guy, so I'm not 100% sure. We have Wolverine, our friend here. Uh, this one went really hot on my last Whatnot show for some reason. was just going crazy. I'm guessing it's because the new Wolverine is coming out. People want to buy him before he's expensive. Uh, there's Printed Arms Spider-Man. Not much to see there. We do have Triangle Chest Iron Man as well. That's a great one. You know me and Iron Man. I love me some Iron Man. Green Cape, of course. Love those. Magneto. I don't see the Deadpool in here. That's the one we would want <laughs> of the set. Uh, but those, those two are cool too. These are in great condition, it feels like too. There's a Venom. Not worth too much there. Uh, Loki and an Outrider right there. Or no, that's a Chitari. Sorry, Chitari. Uh, okay, what's the next one? Monster Fighters, Alien Conquest, Pharaoh's Quest, Dino Hunters, Atlantis, etc. This is a pretty, uh, it's a pretty mixed, pretty mixed bag. Let's see what we can find. Let's see what we can find. More capes. Look at that. Look at those capes. Uh, not much there. This guy's awesome. I'm gonna change out his legs if he's not cracked. He's always cracked. He's, he is always, always cracked. Look at this, the uh, Squid Warrior. That's a pretty cool one. Just some old stuff here. Not anything of value too much. I've never seen that torso before. Maybe that was a Build-A-Minifig torso or something like that for Halloween. I have no idea what any of those Build-A-Minifig torsos were. This one is new as well. Maybe this was a Build-A-Minifig as well. I have no idea. I've never seen the Tan Mummy before. Comment below if you've actually ever seen that. I have not, for sure. I'm going to put that one up there, too, because I haven't seen that one either. I'm wondering if there was some Build-A-Minifig. Ooh, look at that old shield. Build-A-Minifig things um, that were cool like that. There's a glow-in-the-dark. Two set, two glow-in-the-dark claws right there. Those are cool, too. Go to the werewolf. All right, we went for Marvel. Let's go ahead and go to DC. DC superheroes. Let's take a look and see what we got here. Uh, we got Freeze. No... Um, visor. That's okay. We got plenty of those. Arctic Batman. That's one I have not had in store forever because I can't find a cape that's clean. This one is relatively clean, so that is going to go up in the store very, very soon. Uh, we'll put him up there just so I remember to uh, get him up there. That way, lickety split. <laughs> There's the old vi or the old cowl, the old type. What is it? Type one cowl in dark blue. That one's a cool fig. Regular Batman. We we never get that guy. Oh, that one's that one's super rare. We got two cronies for Two Face, a penguin. Uh, this one is a Catwoman. We also have Lex Luthor. That guy. Th What's up with his torso? Why does it look like? What in the world? It doesn't feel any different. It's like something's trying to come out of Lex Luthor. <laughs> uh, that's a shame. I use that torso. I saw that fig very very quickly so that's a shame that that one's like that uh this is justin hammer i think or no that's uh that's the superman clark kent face i think uh, if i'm not mistaken this one is simpsons cmf and minecraft looks like they did categorize these things uh beforehand there's the comic book guy gotta love that belly shirt minecraft steve some minecraft fire which i've never seen before and there is the uh 
Simpsons Doctor along with every man is that his that must be their accessories right he's got an x-ray and the other guy's got the everyman comic book it's possible it's possible those come with those i'm gonna put those on there just so i don't forget that as well uh this one is indiana jones team Teenage mutant ninja turtles look at that whoa that one just went flying uh that is a guard i think he's a little beat up though i don't think we're gonna be able to use that one Marion, we got Krang, Michelangelo, and a foot soldier. Put Michelangelo up there. He's pretty good. He's pretty good. We'll, we'll keep him. Uh, Prince of Persia. I've actually been selling some Lone Ranger and Prince of Persia lately. Don't know what it is. Go through some, go through waves sometimes of this kind of thing. I really should have just kept these organized and then put them in where they're supposed to go. I did not think about that until just now. <laughs> that's a bummer that's okay though i'll just organize it when i'm organizing everything else uh that one is super dirty we're not gonna be able to use that one uh more prince of persia faces i actually did need some of those faces for some other figs i think and then there's the regular prince of persia fig right there uh star wars put it right in the middle for you put it right in the middle for you let's take a look and see what we got here there is some grievous parts uh looks like a head a torso and two arms of a grievous fantastic uh, just a snow trooper there, not much to see. A storm trooper. Hey, that guy's got a uh, old school scout visor. That's pretty cool. This one is a Dooku face, but wrong body. Old brown cape, which is kind of cool. Not in the greatest condition, but it is still pretty cool. Uh, Dooku's head is uh, good. We'll use that one for sure. Might use the old brown cape too. Uh, Bib Fortuna. This is the old original Bib Fortuna before they made him uh, tan, beige, I guess you could say. Naboo, we got one of the newer Scouts, the Scout Girl. I actually do sell that one. I have a listing for that one, so that's always good when I have listings for them already. We have some Harry Potter here. Uh, Narcissa, that's a great one right there. Don't know what that one is. I think it's like a potion or something like that. There's a Dementor, super creepy looking Voldemort who got his face scratched off by a cat or something. Uh, here's a Butterbeer, that's pretty cool. Uh, Ron, Harry... Lupin and Sprout, looks like, and a Slytherin torso. Uh, what is this stuff? This is our Ninjago stuff, it looks like. There's a spinner, so there's some of the weight that came out of that. Uh, OG, Cole, and Jay, and um, Crazy, I think is his name. His face is probably back there, too, somewhere. <laughs> there's an old chrome uh, samurai helmet, too. OG Kai right there, too, look at that. Look at that, some accessories, stuff like that. Not much to see there. Uh, this one's Pirates of the Caribbean, it looks like. Some good pieces in here. Parts and pieces will do. Uh, parts and pieces to both of the mermaids, it looks like. Uh, we will use the blue tail there too. There is Captain Jack with his tricorn hat. I've been selling that thing like mad as well. That one's pretty good. Put that one up there. This one is the Coachman, I think, or something to that effect. Don't remember what his his value was. And then there's Barbosa as well. Love me some Pirates of the Par Caribbean figs. I tell you what, put those things up there. They are, uh, they're fantastic. They've aged. They've aged quite nicely, like a fine cheese. <laughs> or wine, depending on how old you are. Uh, here we have Sandy Cheeks. We'll put that one in stock as well. It's a good one. Fairly good. Uh, we're going to put them in an order here. There is crabs. This one's not as good as this one, obviously, but they are pretty good figs. We'll put those up there. Uh, Patrick, not so much. Super SpongeBob. And is this Super Patrick? Nope, just regular Patrick. So we got some SpongeBob. Maybe I'll leave them somewhat, somewhat organized. There's Plankton and the bottom tail of a Flying Dutchman, which is always kind of neat. Uh, what else we got? We got Chima. Chima, Chima, Chima. Chima, Chima, Chima. I wish I could do it deeper. Jumo, Jumo, Jumo. <laughs> Jumo, Jumo, Jumo. Uh, oh, my voice cracked right there. I should have stopped at the first two. Uh, so Chima. Needs some arms, it looks like. That's just going to go in the Chima bag. I don't care about Chima. Uh, I will. I will care about Chima when I eventually have time to go through it. But, you know, that's, that's never. So wish me luck on that. Wish me luck. There's a scientist. CMF scientist. And we also have Anna. And what else do we have here? A bat and a wily coyote. That one's kind of a cool pick. A chip. The black nose, I believe, is chip. 
and then some pieces, some early series figs there as well. So not a whole lot, but hundred bucks, it's whatever. Uh, lots and lots of pizzas to use, so that'll be just fine. No problem, no problem. Nothing like a huge score, but uh, it's just stock inventory. Always keeping up with the stock monster. <laughs> that's that's the toughest thing is uh, in this business. It's harder and harder to find stock for a reasonable price where you can actually expect to make money. A lot of people are re requesting tons and tons of money, like retail or over retail, which doesn't make any sense because it's like you don't just get full retail price for selling it all at once. That's just not how it works. If you want to do the work and sell them one at a time, that's all cool. But uh, I was talking to some other sellers and they're just like, oh my God, the amount of people contacting me and saying they want just astronomical prices for just selling something all at once and not having to do any work is just crazy. Us resellers, we cannot pay you full retail because it doesn't make sense. We can't even pay you 70% of retail because it still doesn't make sense because we pay 25% in selling fees. So it's, you know... It is what it is. Anyways, love you guys. Thank you very much for contacting me. Uh, I totally forgot. Blake. Blake, that was the name. <laughs> Blanked out there. And uh, I'll catch you guys on the next one.